What's up guys, we're back with an epic video. Today we're gonna to be opening two of my favorite recent products. Not that recent, but a few years old at this point, but not crazy old. So, before that, the giveaway. I'll be giving away these three cards. Yes, this is an ultimate rare. We have Red Eyes Darkness Dragon First Edition and the Penguin Soldier First Dead. All you have to do, like the video, be subscribed, let me know what you think about these products. What is your opinion about how good they are? Uh, did you like them? Did you open them when they came out, etc.? All right, so I got these products from the one and only Sassiato. There's all his information. I've recommended him many times. He sent me these. He also has some of these available on his eBay store. I'm gonna have them linked below. Use code Ruxin10, that's Ruxin, T-E-N, if you guys wanna get 10% off your order, up to $25 saved. So he has Legendary Collection Joey's World. I think these are first edition, we're about to find out. I can't remember. I think you can tell by the back. Let's check this out, wait. Yeah, they're first edition because this is the way you tell on these legendary collections for like uh, the mega packs. If it says first edition up there, I've seen these on the Kaiba ones as well. If it says first edition on those mini packs, that means it's first edition. If it says it's unlimited, it doesn't. So that's how you tell, it's really strange. It doesn't say like first edition on the front, it says it on those really small packs. Very weird way to do it, but it actually works apparently. We're gonna test that theory to make sure by opening this, but he has these available and he also has these, the Kaiba's Collector Box. Yeah, so it's a really big box, so it's hard to show. This is one of the first products I bought when I came back. It actually is the first product and I pulled Chaos and Brewer Dragon. You guys have heard that many times. We're gonna open this up today, but first we're gonna start with the Joey. We're gonna go one thing at a time here because um, yeah, they're really big boxes and hopefully get some epic pulls. So these should be first edition boxes. This set is super cool because it has a ton of goat support, like a lot of really cool goat seeker rares. Not as much as Yugi's World, which was like literally a goat set basically, but it's uh, second to that. It's pretty close. All right, so we have Jinzo on the front. We got Gilford the Lightning. We got uh, Gearfried the Swordmaster, I think. A lot of cool stuff. Yes, and there it is. First edition packs, guys. So it looks like the trick works. All right, let's get all these. Okay, how many packs is it? Five, I think. It's only five packs. This used to be a $30 product. I think they're a lot more now. But I remember opening these, uh, getting them from like Walmarts and stuff when I was first getting back into it. So we have the promos. I'm going to keep this sealed probably. But there's the Blue Flame Swordsman's the, bi the big one. After that, it's just some other stuff. But it's a pretty cool one. I think they're actually they have the scapegoat tokens, which is really nice as well. Yeah, so this ha those have a little bit of value. Actually, pretty nice stuff. Then we have the five packs. Let's see what we can pull here. And then we're going to go into that Kaiba collector box, which is pretty cool. So this is a mega pack. So it'll have a super, an ultra, and a secret all in one pack, which is pretty cool. And a rare, I think. Uh, do we have a misprint? What is this? That's a weird misprint. Wait, okay, come on, focus here. Look at that, guys. What happened there? It's a little, little weird touching that. I don't know what that is. Oh, an upside. What is going on? We are. Oh, we have a crazy pack. We're starting off with an, an error pack. Upside down. First of all, we have a misprint. Then we have an upside down card. Okay. And then it goes back for the ultra rare. What is going on? These are crazy. These are crazy. Oh, a pot of avarice with the huge print line. Oh my, the, the quality control. What is going on? Check that line out. Guys, this is one of the best pulls, I think. This is a really good card. Okay, the focus right now is going a little bit crazy. I don't know what the deal is. Look at that. Secret rare pot of avarice. That's a nice card. That is one of the worst print lines I've ever seen. That is really terrible. Harpy's, uh, oh, kunai with chain. What is this? There we go. Harvey's Hunting Ground. Cool. So you can see all the cool nostalgia cards in here. Gotta love it. And, uh, oh, we skipped the baby, the baby Seru, 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 Baby Sarasaurus. Got it. I nailed it. All right. So that's a great start to this opening. That's a crazy pack, though. There's a huge print line. There was a weird misprint error, upside down card. I mean, I don't know. Is that going to be like that in every pack? We're about to find out. We got some craziness. We've got the Dark Dust Spirit. I think this card's uh, a little bit crazy, a little hard to, hard to play. Strike Ninja, from originally from Invasion of Chaos. Zombie Masters from Tactical Evolution. Lava Golem, for Ronnie Guardian Secret Rare. Ooh, the Harpy's Pet Dragon, that's awesome. Ultra Rare card. And a Destroyer Source, interesting. The Destroyer Source Secret Rare. Hysteric Party. Ooh, that's a cool vanilla. They put kind of threw those vanillas in here, which was pretty pretty interesting. And Harvey's Pet Baby Dragon. A lot of cool cards in there. 
Okay, I attempted to fix the lighting. I think that was why the focus was just going nuts for some reason. I think it was where the, the light was coming. I don't know. Something weird was going on, but it, I think we might have fixed it. We'll see. All right. Amazon. Okay, we didn't fix it. I don't know what's going on right now, but we got Amazon as fighter. We got a guild for the legend. Gravekeeper's Priestess. Heavy Storm. Cool for your goat decks. Ooh, speaking of goat decks, Secret Rare, Scapegoat, and another Hysteric Party. Oh, look at uh, two of them. The Rude Kaiser's in here. That's awesome. So we got a... Wow. An absolutely awesome one. Heavy Storm and Scapegoat in the same pack. That's absolutely amazing. Check that Secret Rare out. That's pretty awesome. Might have to play that in some of my decks. Okay. Two more packs here, guys. So far, three packs in. Yeah, I love this product. Super fun. So you guys can get these. Just check out Sassy Auto down below. Use code RUXIN10, T-E-N at the end, not T-O, or not 1-0, not T-O. Uh, T-O either would also not work. But yeah, use that. You guys can get up to $25 off. You can buy as many as you want. You get Your max savings is $25, 10% under that. So pretty cool. Baby Saurus, and that's for this and the Kaiba. A deal with Dark Ruler, that's a rare. Dunamis Dark Witch, classic tournament pack eight super rare and the cabazals we got the dino secret rare and super rejuve is in here i didn't know that skull stalker that's a cool one where is that originally from maybe a tournament pack or a champion pack something like that all right final pack of legendary collection joey's world here we go Let's see what we can do here such a fun set i love these legendary collection like joey and yugi especially just so awesome Nostalgic cards, goat cards, I mean, just lovable cards right there. Lesser Fiend. Harpy Queen, that's probably pretty valuable, actually. They reprinted this in the Lost Art. What are the freaking chances? That is crazy. Wait, there's a... Metal Reflex Slime is in here, too? Okay, wow. Okay, first of all, Double Pot of Avarice is insane. I mean, that's a great pull. This one does not have the crazy print line, which is great. Thank goodness that one doesn't. And then we got a Metal Reflex Slime. I wonder if that's worth something. This card was worth something because there was hardly any printings. And then they had a, a reprint at some point. I don't remember what it was, but pretty cool. So uh, pretty successful right there. We're doing pretty good so far. All right, next we get into this Kaiba Collector's Box. It's so large. I'm going to have to open it off screen. It has three of the uh, Duelist Pack Kaiba, which have potential ultimate rare CED. When I first got back into Yu-Gi-Oh, I opened this up at Walmart. Well, I got it at Walmart. And then I pulled the CED ultimate rare, which was amazing. I didn't even know what it was at the time. There's also an ultimate rare Blue Eyes in the starter deck in here. So there's just some really awesome value in here. Of course, there's the starter or the Duelist Pack Yugi. I keep saying starter deck. There is a starter deck. It's Kyber Reloaded. But they give you an Ultra Rare Blue Eyes, which is cool. One Blue Eyes. Then they also give you the Large Blue Eyes, which is very difficult to get out. So we get that. We got the Huge Blue Eyes, which is cool. Then you get six Duelist Packs. These things used to be like 20 bucks retail, and then they would put them on sale for even less, which was awesome back in the day. So there's three of these. You can get the Ultimate Rare uh, Pot of Greed in here. You can get the CED. You can get the Crush Card. You can get Cyber Jar. I think there might be one more. And then uh, three of these, which don't have Ultimate Rares. Tell me whose decision that was. Just the worst decision. It doesn't even make sense. They're like, it was a Kaiba fan. It was, whoever made these was a Kaiba fan. That's all I'm saying. All right, so we're, we're probably not going to open this thing up because uh, I've actually opened 10 of these or 10 of the Yugi and Kaiba combined first edition. So if you guys want to check those out, I'll link that video up in the eye. But... We're not going to open that this time. We are just going to open these six packs. We have Duelist Pack Kaiba, Duelist Pack Yugi. Let's start with, let's just go alternate. Let's start with Yugi and we'll go to Kaiba and back and forth. Uh, Yugi pretty much cannot compare because it only has ultras and supers for some reason. It really baffles me. Why? It makes absolutely no sense why they did that. Maybe, did Yugi come out first? Maybe that's why. All right, maybe it can compare. We got a Mirror Force Ultra Rare on the first pack and a Dark Magician. Okay, pretty good first pack. Pretty good first pack. Mirror Force. That's awesome. I'm, what I'm guessing is, I'm, I'm going to fact check myself probably after I record the video, but uh, they pro I know they released these before they did this in first edition. So they probably released the Yugi one and didn't do ultis. And then they released Kaiba and they're like, we should have done ultis. Let's do ultis now. And so Yugi just kind of got, you know, screwed. <laughs> Familiar Knight. Let's get an ultimate rare. Enrage Battlehawks and Different Dimension Dragon. 
I think that the ultimate rares are pretty tough to pull. I'm not sure what the exact ratios are because I think you get two in the first edition boxes, but they're 36 packs. So I don't know if it's one every 18, if that's right or not. Uh, you guys can check out when I opened a first edition box of that. It was crazy. It was awesome. Spellbinding Circle. Karibo. And Card of Sanctity it allows you to draw six cards. All right, next pack. Duelist Pack Kaiba. This is going to be a shorter video than I thought. Um, because there's really not that many packs in these. It's five and six packs. Can we get the ulti CED? Pot of Greed would be awesome as well, because you can put that in your goat deck. Ultimate Rare Bling. Even if it's unlimited, who cares? Sword Stalker. Iconic. Six Star 2000. Ooh, the Dragon Master Knight and Paladin of White Dragon. The classic 5,000, 5,000. So cool story about this. When I pulled that CED, you guys have heard this already. A lot of you, but some of you haven't. I opened one of these packs. Inside, I got first. Dragon Master Knight was the third card. I was like, oh, awesome. This card's amazing. Next card, CED Ultimate Rare. Fourth card. Fifth card, a rare. So I got a rare, an ultra, and an ulti in one box. It was insane. It was absolutely insane. I don't know how it happened, but I'm pretty happy about it. It was pretty awesome. Okay, two packs left here. We've pulled amazing in this video. <laughs> Just absolutely amazing. Only thing that can top is pull an ultimate rare out of Duelist Pack Kai, but can we pull the Dark Paladin here out of Yugi? Catapult Turtle, Strong Called the Moving Fortress. Polymerization, one of the best cards in here. This is a pretty valuable super because the alternate art, a lot of people like more. I like the original art just because it's nostalgic, but three foils out of six packs. I mean, that's crazy for these. It's crazy. Ultimate rare though, could chop it off. We could do it. Oh, there's the original, the classic art, the poly. It's, it's not hollow though, so. x head Cannon, here we go. Like button for luck, guys. Here we go. I was about to say like the button, but you couldn't like the button. Just do it. Make sure it's make sure it's nice and uh filled out. You gotta fill out that button. And oh, did you say your subscribe button's red? Oh, so disappointing. Come on, guys. Why dragon head? Okay, vampire lord. Pretty awesome. Let's go over what we got. All right, guys, we got a ton of cool cards. We got these promos from Legendary Collection Joey's World First Edition. Pretty cool. We also got here the few of the cards we got that I see. There's some other cards as well. We got the blue eyes promo, Polly, Dragmaster Knight, Mirror Forces, three out of six. Scapegoat first edition secret rare, that's cool. And two pot of avarice. How about that? There are some other epic pulls as well, but that's all we're gonna go over. But if you guys want to buy some of these, check out my link down below to Sassy Auto's eBay store. You can use code Ruxin10, that's Ruxin T E N for a discount of 10% up to $25 saved. Check these out. First edition, legendary collection, Joey's World, and the Kaiba Collector's Box. Pretty awesome stuff. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, like the video and be subscribed for more epic content. And I'll see you guys later. Peace. Oh. Elemental Hero, Dark Bright. Boom. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>